Hey what's up guys I'm Lan here welcome back to a new video on my channel so in this video I'm going to talk about iPad OS 15 beta 2 update that I have received day before yesterday yes so first let me go to the settings let me go to the general and about section if i go to this details section as you can see it says the software version is 15 and the build number is 19a 52818 so as of now that's a build number and also i had taken a screenshot before so let me just show you quickly uh, about the detail size and all so if i go to the photos and tap on photos as you can see i had taken a screenshot before so it came in about 1.34 gigabytes on my iPad 8 generation. So as you can see, it's clearly mentioned iPad OS 15 Developers Beta 2. So in this video, quickly, I'm gonna go through the visual changes. I'm not gonna go through all the detailed changes and the bug fixes, but quickly, I'm gonna go through uh, what are the visual changes and what are the the few changes that you would be actually able to notice. So in this video, I'm gonna just talk about that. But before that, uh, let me show you something else uh, that this is running on iPad OS 15. And if you don't know, this is an iPad. at a generation so then again with that being said let's get right into the video but before that if you're new here and happen to enjoy this kind of videos on my channel then definitely do give this video a thumbs up and also consider subscribing to the channel because it gives me a lot of motivation to make more of this kind of videos for you guys now with that being said let's get right into the video All right guys so the first things first before you know starting the video first let me go to the photos a section again and show you the software details so as you can see it clearly says iPad OS 15 developers beta 2 so the size is around 1.34 GB which i received on my iPad 8 generation so as i showed you before so as you can see it's a model name says clearly it's iPad 8 generation now let me just go over the visual changes quickly so first thing i notice is if i tap on this widget section so there's a new widget specially for music so if i tap on this music So if I scroll here there's a large music widget that we can now place on our home screen and you know it's it's pretty large and uh, this this widget was not there earlier but now it is there now talking about one more functionality that i like now previously many of you have talked about this quick note feature so if you you know uh, just do like this then you know your quick note would be available then you can you know type anything for subscribe me like hey how you are doing today and then you know if you click on done then it will be again gone now with ipad os 15 beta 2 that gesture is now available with fingers as well so now as you can see clearly if i do it without apple pencil without the finger so again the quick note feature is available so then again this was a very nifty and helpful feature so previously i was not able to do with my fingers so i had to use this stylus So now you know with this uh, with fingers I can easily access the quick note. So that's the thing I like about this iPad OS 15 beta 2 update. Talking about the visual changes there aren't many but as you can see the maps icon has now been updated. So let me just you know uh, focus a little bit so you can see clearly. So if I tap on this maps option as you can see so the maps looks uh, very similar. it's just that the icon has been updated as you can see uh, so like this there are refinements as well now let me go to the settings and let me show you the battery as well because most of the people you know talk about the battery life so as i said before the battery life has not been great on my ipad so it's just you know uh, you know just 24 hours have started using this ipad os beta 2 update so let me use this for a couple of days i will come back to you with a follow up review how is ipad os 15 beta 2 is working for me apart from that there are many changes within the settings within the accessibility i am not going to go to detail and going to bore you about those details because it's about the visual changes right for most of the people and also it's about the comfort so i just wanted to talk about this quick note feature so which is now available through finger swipe so this is really helpful and apart from that the music widget and you know the few nifty changes what you are able to see on my ipad so then again this was a very quick video regarding ipad os 15 beta 2 then again this is the software details and the update size which i have received on my ipad 8 generation anyway for that matter if you would like to download the ipad os 15 then you have to you know open your safari and you know search in google download ipad os beta profile and then once you download the profile go to settings import the profile 
then the process is very easy just restart your ipad search for the update you would be able to find ipad os beta mind it this update contains many bugs and this is not a stable update stable update is going to come in the month of september or october for ipad so nevertheless if you have a secondary device you are free to try ipad os beta so i hope you like the video and like the visual changes and few changes i talked about in this video do give this video a thumbs up and also consider subscribing to the channel it motivates me a lot now with that being said i will see you on my next video bye